This is our first time at the San Diego Asian Film Festival, and spoiler alert, we love it. It's been really fun to like have all these filmmakers come back after so long of like not seeing each other. I know we had last year as well, but this year it was like a little more special because we had our awards dinner back again and everyone was coming together and it was really nice to see all these filmmakers like have a community with each other at the San Diego Asian Film Festival that like all of us have been missing for so long. At first I thought it, it was just like some local Asian American niche festival but then when I uh, started doing more research into what the festival is and the alumni that have been here, I was absolutely blown away and I'm uh, really deeply honored to be here. Sadaf is always fun. <laughs> I've I met some of my best filmmaker friends here. I get to see them at other film festivals and it's always like, oh, we're the only Asian Americans here, but that's sick. <laughs> like, Sadaf is always so generous and welcoming. I would hope that my film can encourage other BIPOC filmmakers to do their own searching within their own families. I think so many films can be made on just any BIPOC filmmaker's experience. This is my uh, 12th year uh, at the San Diego Asian Film Festival. It is important for us to uh, expand awareness about uh, films from other countries, especially Asia, so people can learn more, not just about films in general, but uh, documentaries about issues that are happening in Asia. I think ultimately it's always about finding different ways to build community power. In that process it's also, you know, questioning like what are the unfreedoms that we are also contributing in, to in this process and what do we have to actually let go of while we do this work um, and at the same time how do we take the skills that we have that are all different, so like how do I take the skills that I have as an architect to try to do work to move towards liberation or to move towards building community power. I think it, it really helps to amplify like the perspective of Asian Americans and then also Asians in general, you know, like the filmmakers, the actors, people who work in the film and on the crew. Representation is important for people who are, you know, like if they're aspiring to be a director, it's like not that common in Hollywood, directors of Asian descent or even just like actors and actresses. So I think it's important for that reason. Every time I've come to this film festival, I've just felt a real sense of warmth from, from everybody that kind of works here and from the audience as well. And there's a real sense of welcoming in, in the festival that's always been there. And I think obviously getting back after COVID as well, you feel that there's a bit of energy there in terms of people wanting to get out, wanting to connect, wanting to be moved and, or have a good time. <laughs>